Hello guys, JFG is here. So finally, we got a Christmas present for us on June 30. Vic is gonna drop. We have a fix, guys. Finally, after a long time of waiting, we have a confirmation on when Vic is gonna drop. So let's just get into it. So Commander like Legion Commander Vicus and the Guardian Kungalanium alongside with Solo Throne Spire Dungeon. So there are a lot of contents to come uh, for us. So the Solo Throne Spire Dungeon, I heard they're gonna give you like two legendary books. So that is a good thing. It's really good for character progression. So next thing that we have also is Stronghold Research. If your main already reach like 4 and 60. You can increase your alt honing rate up to 4 and 15. So this is a good thing, at least for me. I'm a cheapo. I don't want to burn a lot of money to ha to gear up my alts. So this is a good thing. And this is like a Christmas present, like I tell you. Because a lot of people want to do Valton more than once. Uh, and that's also me. I mean, slapping that Valton is fun. Like, I want to kill that bull more often so if people can do this more often that means you can expect more supports in the near future so yeah i also have my bars i want to bring her to valton just to just smack that bowl down okay and yeah that's it next thing they were they're trying to mention about the bots i mean as you know the bots infestation the war against the bots we finally it's uh, they, they release a band wave and the band wave is kind of working for at least as you can see right here it goes down uh previous week it is at 100k player and now it's down to 250. it's kind of sad to see to be honest uh to see that the player is only 250 but at least this 250 is a real player who actually played the game there are still bots in this though I tell you that, I mean, you cannot eradicate bots almost completely. It's really, really hard to do that. But it is what it is. At least 250-ish player base is kind of okay for an MMORPG. It's thriving. So it's a good thing to see. At least they're heading to, towards a good direction. And I hope this keeps continue. So next thing. Uh, one thing that is quite inter interesting right here is they decide to remove the Yoss jar. So there's an explanation why uh, below, but they just explain in this paragraph they just explain about the crystal and the gold exchange system. Nothing too fancy about this one. So moving on, but the Yoss jar uh, TLDR because the skin. Everyone wants it, of course, including me. And it's also legendary, so it gives you like a decent stats. It gives you like a small edge onto the fight. So people definitely want to get this. Some people, some people don't though. But in their opinion, they think that it might cause an inflation onto the gold prices. So they just get rid of it. As we know, they want everyone to have like the same gameplay experience, especially the free-to-play players. So, the fact that they trying to do this, the explanation behind it, I will say it's, it make complete sense. So, I'm okay with this one. And yeah, I hope it's gonna be released soon when... I don't know, when it is the right time. I think that's the fit word to describe this one. Okay, moving on. Next one is a player gift. Thank God they know where out of uh, our patience is gonna be uh, paid for whatever reason. Yeah, thank God. So they're gonna give us a gratitude gift. So it's a growth support pack. It gonna give us like a destruction stone, guardian stone, and honing shot. And I actually need like a leapstone. That is the most important thing among all. But there's none in here. But I mean, it is what it is. I'll I'll take it anyway. So I'm happy. So next thing is the Makoko suit. Finally, we can meme around with our destroyer, I guess, with this Makoko suit. Yay! More skins. Yeah, it is a good thing. 
Available claim weekly downtime up in June. Ah, oh, okay. So it is gonna be available on. Yeah, I mean it's gonna be available. So yeah, okay then. And then the store update. So the store update, they're gonna release the Shadow Stern collection. This is the skin. This is the most important for me. I love skins and I want to collect them. And looking at the skin, I'm down for it. It looks pretty cool, at least for me. I want to buy this probably for my death plate. I mean, fashion is endgame, right, guys? So I don't know. I'm down for this one. All right. So that's it for this update patch, guys. What do you guys think? Do you guys think this is a good patch or there should be a better things to be included in this patch? Let me know in the comments down below what you guys think at least for me the two the two things that really excite me is the vicus of course and also the stronghold research because i want to do like more legion raids on the future and it's gonna help me like in significantly and by huge a lot i mean so i think this is all for now and I'm going to see you guys on the next video. Peace.